It's beautiful, isn't it? This is Wellington College International Shanghai's main campus from way above. The vast community has over 1,500 pupils from early years who learn nearby at the Early Years Center through to prep and senior school. Hello, I am Victor and welcome to Wellington. I am a Wellington parent and today I am going to take you around. Come with me. The campus is made up of five key buildings with a large grassy field, grandstand, astroturf pitch, and a massive undercover sports dome. Let's head to the main reception. It's nice to stand here at the first floor art gallery and just admire. Ooh, look at that, it's the House Cup. All the pupils and staff at Wellington are put into houses, which is like their own team throughout their time at the college. There really is a great spirit of competition here. Winner takes home the House Cup. Ah, here's one of my favorite areas. As a parent, I care about the values that are being nurtured within and around my child and the kind of person they will grow up to become in the world. Here, you can see the Wellington values and identity proudly displayed along this high traffic corridor along with wonderful images that demonstrate these in action. Right here is Pupil Services. They are dedicated to taking care of our children's well-being and safeguarding. It is so important that our children get all the support they need in a kind, caring, and targeted way and always look after for their personal, social, and academic development. Oh, we are just outside the admissions office. Wow, here's some great photos and memories of the Friends of Wellington, where I am secretary of the core committee. The parent community is dynamic. Together, we help to organize some of the college's biggest events, such as the Summer Festival, International Food Fair, and the Annual Ball. Here is where pupils learn Chinese. Being in Shanghai and China, as a parent, I believe it is so important that our children are culturally aware of the context we are living in. At Wellington, there is a fantastic Chinese program and some parents I know have children on the dual language pathway, which is teaching children to be bilingual in both English and Chinese. Impressive! At Wellington, the full range of subjects are taught from science, and robotics to design, technology, and art. English, math, economics, geography, psychology, you name it. So much to learn. And read. We're now in the library. From nonfiction to fiction, there's a wealth of titles and research resources. And the space is very comfortable too. Look here, this is one of the playgrounds the children play nearby. This is the main dining hall where some of the pupils eat. There is a range of healthy, nutritious food, drinks, and snacks available for both Western and Eastern tastes. Upstairs on the fourth floor is where the college theater is. Welcome. As a parent, I love to come and watch the talented pupils of Wellington perform. From the dance shows to the musicals and drama pieces, there is always something to watch. Oh, look at that view. Check it out. You can see the tennis courts, basketball courts, the fields, and the dome in the distance. Only thing missing are the swimming pools, 
gym, and sports hall from up here. If your child is not into the arts, there's plenty of sports teams to join, and also great opportunities for us parents to watch and support. Go Lions! Here we are in the sixth form center designed for those in years 12 and 13, the most senior pupils. Here, pupils can study and socialize as well as prepare themselves for higher education and the careers. I, myself, came in to give a career talk, sharing my own experiences of the working world. Finally, here we are in the V&A coffee shop, which stands for Victoria and Albert, part of the Wellington heritage from the UK. It really is a perfect pit stop if I am joining a parent workshop or waiting for pickup time. Hey, speaking of time, I best head over to the uniform shop just over there before it closes. Thank you so much for joining me on my tour today. I hope you enjoyed the visit and got some insights into the thriving community and school that is Wellington. Bye-bye now.